Dixon and my research is on tornado seasonality and then I've gone a step farther and based on the tornado seasons that we calculated, we've done some tornado density analysis for the entire U.S. Uh, broken down by the five different seasons and those seasons were identified based on storm speed and the speeds were based on daily average speed as portrayed by National Weather Service text-based warnings. And also in those, the methods for calculating the seasons are daily average tornado path. And what we see is that we have uh, you know, the four seasons we would expect, winter, spring, summer, and fall, and then a very down season that we're calling pre-fall. Um, I guess the big take-home message here is that storm speed changes dramatically uh, from the fall and winter seasons to the spring and summer, and that lots of high tornado activity areas in the southeast have one long season beginning around October and stretching through the month of May.